attack and use your judo, you know. Yes? Of course, if somebody pulls you forward, you're not going to stay there. You're going to be pulled forward and you must always follow up many, many techniques. Okay? Yes. Right, we'll just start with a little technique for you to practice. It's very nice. We did the little movement earlier on, which was like moving the floor. So what happens, if you got to grab it with this Okay? And it's going to grab hold the line. So our first movement is to deflect it. Just grab it. So I gain control of his arm. Even if he grabs, it doesn't matter. I'm over the top grab. Next thing is going to reach for this arm. What I do now is move my body backwards, just move the shoulder, and I come over the top and grab the arm. Very simple. Now because he's leaning into this technique and because I'm moving backwards, I'm feeding him onto it. So I'm making him break his own balance. He doesn't know this is happening. So from here, look, and he comes here, I take the arm. And now I've got him off balance. I've got two hands here. Very simple, what I'm going to do now is use the kushushi here, bring him up, step in, straight the way through, step forward, take him to Okay, watch again. Hit cross -trap. Oh, sorry. Okay, here, grab here. Then, Taboko. Anyone tell me the name of the technique? So the Surikomi Goshi. What you do? Okay, yeah, grab. Yeah. And I need to be aware of this. So I don't want him to grab hold. So I've got to be very quick to grab over the top. Lean back. Take him off. Step right the way through here. Your hands are here. Good control. Step forward. Take him over the top. Control. And you got it. Okay? Now, the technique here is, is not that important. It's the way I learned to use my body. Okay? Which is here. Okay? And this movement as well. I feed him onto him. Okay, yeah. I think straight on. It's left handed technique, very, very nice, but again, it's allowing yourself to be able to turn it. Now, don't stand with your leg there, you're coming with your right leg forward and you take hold. Okay, now he could come with his hand first, so I gain control from here. Then, once I've got in control, he's going to try to grab with his hand and I grab it. So I could block here. Grab here, or I could grab here, in here. Up, straight up. Oh, get your hips in, deep. Look, he goes off. You grab underneath when you come into turn. Look how hard my hands twist A lot of pressure. Yeah, it's better because you can push up without your hand getting uh, twisted, not powering. Yeah? What we don't want to do is to twist. Because that's a weaker grip. So grab over the chest. Step. Hip. Very powerful. Yeah? Good control. Don't score a point straight down to me, was it? Um, Uki is attacking left handed. Okay? From here. So you've got to do it with your left foot forward. Okay? Uh, you should, especially for you. Left handed attacks. Okay? Here. Right here. Right. Right here. In, nice and deep. Straight out. Don't pull down. I don't want to make him heavy. I want nice circular kuzushi, takuri, everything working together. You've got to bring everything you do is bring Yuki on, onto his toes. Now, if you just stand here, he's going to grab you, he's going to control you. So, the idea with you is you learn to move up. Okay? If your leg happens to be outside, it's no problem. Just a quick step through. Okay, from here. But there's a boom here. Lots of movement. If I don't break his balance, step in. Here. Yeah. It's not going to work. Okay. So we'll just work on that for now. So the Tsurikomagoshi. Tori right handed. Okay, left handed. Very common situation.